So Mark Holy has been a part of the global movement for an independent Sikh nation called Khalistan, which India sees as a threat. Last year, one of his fellow activists in Canada was shot dead, spreading fear through the movement. Worried and concerned, I would definitely say. I'm worried and concerned for the safety of others, definitely. In September, Canada made a bombshell announcement, accusing Indian agents of being involved in the assassination of the separatist in Vancouver, Hardeep Singh Nijar. Sikh separatists in Canada, the US and the UK have since been warned by authorities in their countries that their lives are in danger. We can reveal officers from Australia's intelligence agency, ASIO, have been meeting with separatists in Australia too. I think a week after the assassination, I met with ACO again and well, like told you this is going to happen and then the question was whether we feel that threat is real in Australia. And I think that it's, everything is possible. India says claims it's assassinating dissidents overseas are absurd and has called on Canada to prove its accusation. Nine months on, that hasn't happened. Protesters supporting a Khalistan nation in Punjab say this is just strengthening their movement. People are being killed on foreign soils extrajudicially. They, they give us enough reasons to keep our fight going. Indian intelligence are watching the separatists every move. And during our investigation, authorities pressure us too. You can probably see over here a police officer's come. He's told us that we are not going to go inside. It's just really bizarre. The tension has been building every day that we've been shooting this story. These protesters say they're not scared to die for their cause and will keep fighting. Avani Dias, ABC News, Punjab.